Welcome again. In this video, we're going to take a look at uh, the host registration using a Lisp in the SD access. So in the last lesson, we looked at how DHCP operation worked. And once the host has got the IP address via DHCP server, uh, as discussed in the last video, the edge switch is going to perform a few steps to register the host. So first of all, it adds the endpoint MAC and IP address in its local database. So this is endpoint ID. So the MAC address and IP address. Traditionally, switches only store the MAC address, but the SD access switches have the ability to read the MAC and IP from the packet and store that in the local database. The next step, the edge switch is going to register the endpoints MAC and IP address with the control plane node. And this is the this is where the Lisp comes into play. This registration is done via a Lisp register message, which is sent across from the edge node towards the control node. And in there is sending a Lisp register message containing the IP and an endpoint ID of the endpoint and registering itself with its R lock. So these registrations are stored in the control plane Lisp table, which lists each MAC and IP address with a corresponding R lock IP address of the fabric edge. Thanks for watching. In the next video, we're going to take a look at host operation within the ISD access. Thank <laughs> you.